What's good YouTube, it's Vex. And today I wanted to drop a gem. Today I wanted to drop some information on somebody's head that will change the trajectory of their life. And I promise you that somebody out there, I don't know if all of y'all, but somebody out there going understand my message, resonate with my message, and it's going to completely change your life around. Today is this one tip that I believe can make anybody successful. And the tip itself is you working backwards, bro. You're literally working backwards. In life, we want to work smarter, not harder. It's not about how many hours you work. It's about how much money you make it per hour. And when you start looking at life completely different, and when I give you this gym, it's going to all make sense. A lot of us out there are stuck in comfort, and we can't be stuck in comfort. Comfort is the scariest drug in the world, and it's disguised as dopamine. We all have heard of this word of dopamine, but dopamine is one of the most dangerous and addictive drugs in the, in the world. It literally kills satisfaction. When you're overstimulated with all of this dopamine, you convince your brain that you're doing perfectly okay. You convince your brain that there's nothing to chase, and that is the scary thing. Dopamine, which is what they try to feed us throughout the media, throughout the world, is the drug that keeps the population at bay. It keeps people from gene chasing. And it's the reason that you haven't started chasing your dreams, full head of steam. It's what separates the content creators from the people who consume the content. You have to choose the side. You have to choose one day to wake up and choose your side. Will you be the person who consumes the dopamine or will you create the dopamine for the people? Will you create the content that people want to see? Will you create Will you create the solution that people need? It's up to you to make that decision. Now, the way you're going to make this decision is you're going to have to change the mindset. And the, the way that I changed my mindset is one day I was sitting in my room and I realized that even though I'm taking in all of this dopamine, I'm not satisfied. You know what I'm saying? Even though that I'm doing all of this, I'm not satisfied. And then I asked myself, why do I keep indulging in this dopamine? Why do I keep indulging in this dopamine if it's not bringing me no satisfaction? If I feel, still feel depressed, why am I still doing this? And then it clicked. I might as well do what's difficult. I might as well do what's hard. I might as well wake up seven, eight o'clock in the morning. I might as well go in there, take my shower, brush my teeth, wash my face, handle all of my business. I might as well do everything the right way. Not take no shortcuts, work my butt off and just deal with it because either way it go, I'm not happy. Either way it go, I'm not satisfied. And when you realize that dealing with all of this feel good, doing all of these things like masturbating, having casual sex that don't mean anything, eating junk food, not working out, doing all these things that feel good, they're not making you no happier. And you feel like it making you happier because you comfier, but are you happier? Now, happy and comfort are two different things. Happy and comfort are two different things, and you got to distinguish the two because your whole life you've been putting them two together. Your whole life you've been pairing them two together. You could be comfortable and broke. But do you want to be happy and rich is the question. Do you want to put the work in so that later on in your life, you got money just coming in freely? Do you want to, Are you willing to do that? Or are you willing to just struggle your whole life and keep dealing with the same situations that you've been dealing with? It's up to you. And I promise this one thing is going to wake somebody up and it's going to change somebody's life around because it changed mine. You can keep doing the same thing you're doing and be comfortable. But how satisfying is that? Are you going to be proud of that at the end of your life? I'm asking you. Are you going to be proud of that at the end of your life? Or will you regret not chasing those dreams? Will you regret not putting in that hard work just for a year, just for half a year, just for two years out of your long life? All it takes is one year to change your life. All it takes is one good thing. All it takes is one time. All it takes is a little consistency. 
and you could get there, but will you make the change? The question is up to you. Nobody going to be able to answer that but you. And nobody going to get the result but you. You are of what you make. The life that you live is a reflection of your decisions. What will you decide? I promise you. Somebody out there watching this video and they've been ready to start some type of career. They've been ready to chase some dream, but they ain't been able to do it. They might have dabbled it in a couple times. They might have you know, put their foot half in and then took it out because the time wasn't right, this, that, no. The time is right, right now. Stop procrastinating. You giving yourself excuses and you got to stop being a hoe. You got to get out there and grind, man. Ain't nobody going to give it to you. While you not doing what you're supposed to be doing, somebody out there like me is handling a business. Somebody out there like me is getting ahead of you. And it's only getting more and more competitive. More and more people going to see these videos and more and more people going to be inspired and more and more people going to start actually chasing their dreams. You don't want to get left behind. You don't want to be the man sitting on the curb, no woman, no family, no kids, no money, sad as hell, working that same old job. You don't want to be him. So now what you going to do? I'm putting the ball in your court. I'm throwing you an alley-oop, but you got to finish the dunk. I can't finish the dunk for you. I hope this message got to somebody and if it did make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to join the vex mob i'm giving motivation i'm giving vlogs i also got a second channel where i do the reaction videos i just grew a youtube channel from zero to a thousand subscribers within a week two weeks max from the 19th to the 28th i grew over a thousand subscribers you can do it you just got to be consistent and dedicated you got to eat sleep live and breathe Without further ado, I'm out. Peace and love.